Hey guys, Coupons Provide here, and today I'm coming at you with a friend haul. Of course, it is from Alma. She came across a ton of stuff that she was so generous to give me. Some of it is decor that she picked up and didn't work out in her house, and other pieces were pieces that were gifted to her uh, to do whatever with. And I am so excited that she decided to hold on to them for me. Uh, this. OMG. So now look at, just look at this whole color scheme. Is this not perfect for my house? This is so fitting. We have some white, black, natural wood stuff, greenery, and all kinds of great things that fit into my house perfectly. So anyway, taking a look at this first item. Oh my gosh, is this not the cutest? This is such a beautiful piece. It has really good weight to it. I don't know, I guess it's not iron. It's more of a metal with like an iron coating. It's so, so nice and it's two tiered, a wider tier on the bottom. It's just really, really nice. You could use this to display cups for parties or party wear or fruit, veggies, whatever you want, magazines, books. You could use it any way you like and it's a really great size and I'm so happy to have it. And then this here is actually a magazine rack, but I'm going to be using it for the fireplace because we do have a, a what do you call that thing, a double-sided fireplace thing, and it is like a legit fireplace. You use firewood, so I'm going to actually put this over there with that. She told me to paint it, but I actually love the way it looks as is. It's black. It has some little chippies here and there in the metal, but I mean, I think it's awesome. So I'm going to use that one. And then these... Now these are a cream color with gold hardware. I'm not a big fan of the gold hardware. If I wanted to, I could take it up and spray it, but it's really cute. And I was actually thinking about putting soil into them and using it for like a little garden center type thing because I mean, why not? It's really cute. I don't have counter space for them to be in my kitchen, but I will definitely put them to use. And I'm really thinking that I'm gonna do the whole garden um, jar thing even though not like potting soil but like the nutrients and organic soil for herbs and stuff where you buy a smaller bag and it's a smaller quantity and you put it into smaller pots that's what I'm talking about so there is that I'm going to do something with those and I'm pretty sure I'll keep them as is maybe spray paint the hardware um, all you have to do really is take some pliers and loosen up or unbend this side and it should allow you to move these enough to slip it off of the lid so that being said we'll see what i do with that and then there is this gorgeous black basket so nice she actually painted this one and it has the fabric bag in it and it also has a ton of greenery and we actually have this plant it's like a spider plant and it is so pretty it's a faux plant we have the real one outside and i am so excited to have that because i was actually going to hang some uh draping plants in my breakfast area and then from the entryway area over there out of those cork things that i got from king dollar so these are beautiful and they're so nice and full and whatnot and there are three bunches of those and then she gave me this gorgeous hook piece here all it needs is a little wipe down it's got some awesome hooks on it and it's tattered already like i like it so i'm pretty sure with a quick wipe down i could just hang it up as is it's beautiful those hooks are really solid they're black the base is white with some distressing i love it it's gorgeous okay so then Moving on, there's this shelf here. Now this is partial tin and then it's partial wood. The top up here is a wood strip and then the bottom is tin. And then it looks like it has a darker color underneath so I could actually leave it as is or distress it just a little bit more to get it a little bit more like chipped looking and it'll fit very well with the table that we just made over. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen that. My in-laws actually gave us a table a while back and we have been holding on to it, not able to work on it until finally we have the house cleared out and now it's sitting over there all vertical and I'm so excited to have it in the house as well. So there's that. This is so nice. It's huge. It's probably about 
I'd say two and a half feet or so. It's a gorgeous piece, really gorgeous. And then the last item that she gave me was this huge plant. It's kind of crushed because <laughs> we had it bagged up in the back of the truck. So all I gotta do is fluff it up. And I'm going to, I think I'm, what I'm gonna do with this one is get a nice big basket and I'm going to put something in the big basket to give it height and I'm probably gonna paint the basket a black color but I'm not positive I kind of figure that stuff out as I go so I'm actually gonna probably give it about a foot of height by lifting it putting a little cinder block square in there inside the other basket that I get for it give it some more height it's pretty tall it's about five and a half feet at the top of the leaves so that's not bad at all or actually more than that because I'm 5'5 five five, so it's a little bit taller than me and then well there you go Damien can check it out for you about 5'10". Yeah, about 5'10", almost 6 feet, not bad. And that's because the leaves and stuff are looking kind of sad because we just yanked it out the bag, you know. So there is that. I think this is an amazing haul. Like, thank you so much, Alma. I love you. You have my heart. And I felt so crappy because all I was taking her was some pouches from King Dollar and, like, there was only three of them. So what a lame friend. But we like to trade off. If we find anything for each other, we definitely trade off. And this, I think, was just a very generous haul of things. So that is pretty much it for my friend haul today. I have a quick thrift store haul. You want to sneak a peek? Woo! I got a thrift store haul that I'm going to record next. And uh, that's it. So if you guys enjoy, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Comment, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and my Facebook group at Coupons Provide. And don't forget, guys, keep couponing. Bye.